Steve Lamb. Okay, I'm Meg from Fort Miles with Utah Parents and Teachers Program for House and Children's Services Society, which is down the street. We have three programs. We have Ready Set School, we have Family Education Plan, and we have Utah Parents and Teachers. And I uh, have worked a little bit with Karma and done some trainings. She's done some trainings for us, for our educators. So I'm going to start right in on the the Parents as Teachers program and go from there. The Parents as Teachers program is a program that works with parents who have children prenatally to five years old or kindergarten entry. And this program is for anyone uh, that has um, children that age that would like to have an in-home visitor come either weekly, bi-weekly, or monthly. And that in-home visitor is a professional or a paraprofessional that has extensive training in child development, parenting, and in um, preparation for um, school. That the educator will come into your home for about an hour each month or week, depending on your name, and give you information about those three. So parenting, uh, child development, and then school readiness. And the activities that they provide are specifically for school readiness. Um, you can start getting your baby ready for school, of course, prenatally by reading to your child. So uh, each one of these lessons are specific to the age that your child is. So we have a, uh, a lesson for a one-month-old child up to kindergarten entry. And as you go through, of course, those lessons become less specific to, to the age or birth age because children three to five um, are prepared for kindergarten more generally than those children before three years old. So our educator uh, works in a very positive way. I'm talking about the family strengths and observations that they have about the child and <coughs> parent interaction. And they ask the parent, what goals do you have for your child and how can I help you? And then they go into information that has handouts with that. In, uh, with the lesson, so the parent can refer back to the information and give it to their spouse. So typically it's during the day and we see mothers and then mothers are educated and then are very happy and excited about this information. The fathers aren't as involved and the mothers sometimes forget as I would, you know, exactly what was given to them. So it's, it's a bridge between mom and dad. We encourage the dad to be there and we encourage father involvement, but that's not always possible. Occasionally we have an educator that will go out on Saturdays and in the evenings, but that's a little bit tricky, as you can imagine. So the, our in-home visitation program is funded by the Federal Department of Education, and Obama is putting his mouth where his talk is, we hope, and we'll continue to uh, provide even more money. Uh, our services are pretty limited because of our funding source of limited funds. So we have long waiting lists on all of our, um, at all of our sites. Parents as teachers, our funding um, goes to four different sites. It goes to uh, a center in Vernal, in Utah County, here in Salt Lake, and in Tooele. But we have, um, that curriculum is used by a variety of different programs throughout the state. Early Head Start, Head Starts, Family Supportive Treatment Centers, um, Standalone Programs, um, Housing Authority, School Districts, we have one school district, and the Health Department in Utah County. So there's 27 sites around the state, state that use parents as teachers. Ours is the only universal access, so the four that I mentioned in the first are anyone can um, gain access. We're working, have been working all along to get more funding, and, and there is a lot of support in the Obama administration for funding for, for home visitation. So for more information, you can go to our website at www.utahparentsasteachers.org, or you can go to the state.org. And of course, you can call me and email me at the address you have. Um, I'll go right on to our other programs since I have limited time. 
Uh, Ready Set School is a program that was developed about two and a half years ago. Um, if you have a three to five year old or if you know someone that does, it's going to uh, You can take uh, a copy of this. If you don't, um, we'll just say it in front of people. It is in Spanish, like so we have one copy of Spanish. Uh, if you need Spanish, and our website uh, for this is readysetschool.org. And uh, take are all these websites in your version? They're um, they're on different things. So that website is probably not on the brochure. Oh, it's on my card, okay. and then um, the, the website is here. Some bookmarks. So take several um, of those. Right.org was developed by um, USOE, Utah Family Center, and Utah PTA. And it's um, available in these three formats. One is we call our no text version, which the toolkit. And, and then we have, so you, so you can get these at your libraries. We haven't checked if they're if they disappeared, because we just interviewed them a little while ago. And so we need to check to see how many still have them. So supposedly you can get them at your library. Um, you can get them through us and through the website. So if you just go to the website and click on get one and they're $10. You get them through us, they're $6.50. If you come to get them. If we send them to you, they're ten dollars um, So that's the no-tech version. The low-tech version is in here also. It's the back page. It's the DVD. So that's intended for parents to see real life children do the, the lessons. And one of the children and their parent, the child is, um, has Down syndrome. Down syndrome. I knew that. I knew that. <laughs> uh, a fabulous guy that uh, we filmed when we were doing this. And we have parents of a variety of ethnicities and, and age groups, three five actually. Um, and moms and dads working with them. So that's not intended for your child to be sit, sat in front of the TV and say, oh look, Johnny, if you just listen to this, you'll be ready for kindergarten. <laughs> we make that pretty clear, but you, know, you don't know how, how clear you're getting that message across. That's our low-tech version. Of course, our high-tech version is going to the website. So all of these lessons can be printed off at our website. And you can um, get them and do them with your children. There's 29 that are demonstrated on, on the DVD and then another teen supplementary lessons. So uh, that program is being re kicked off um, August 22nd at the Gateway. So, save the date, you can get into the uh, museum for $3.25 if you go to our website, as opposed to $8.50. Um, so, we hope we'll have lots of attention. And we'll go in, and every family will have the opportunity to. Do several of the activities right there and take home the activity. Um, so, of course, this is relevant for any age child uh, who is preparing at, at any age for kindergarten and their parents. It's based on the USOE pre K guidelines, um, so it's reliable information. It's really simple. That's the main thing. We, we never want to torture a parent or child with kindergarten. So these are, are made to do in about 15 minutes with stuff that you have around the house. We're really invested in no expensive educational materials requirements. So uh, again, the, the website is readysetschool.org. And that's in a nutshell. This is a brand new program that's being kicked off um, the 14th of May at the PTA convention, which is the largest convention or gathering of parents with children in school in the state, it's about three or four times larger than the National PTA Convention. Um, it has 2,000 parents, so you know it's a really good place for you to get information and also to give out information. And we've been connected with PTA for quite a time. So, um, and their website is PTA.org. We have lots of good information about PTA from that website. So this is what I'd like to ask of you. If you have a website that you'd like to link us to be linked to, please email us because we have um, three different websites now that we can. We'd love links from you folks. So the family education plan 
in, in was developed with the same funding streams, and we have basically the same partners. It's housed at the PTA office. Uh, peer involvement is very number one um, goal. And I gave out all the FTP things. So give me one. <laughs> we'll give it back. <laughs> so that website is familyeducationplan.org, and this is what it, why it's relevant to any um, family with any age child. We'd, we'd like to um, have a website, and, and we've searched. There's, this is the only game in town and in state and in the nation that we know that simply gives a parent a place to get a lot of resources to plan for their child's education. From birth, from womb to tomb, as we like to say it all. <laughs> Prenatally, really. So, Everyone knows that when you're going to have a baby, you're very, very concerned with their education, and then it drops off a little bit at a time when you get involved in life. So, we, our goal is to grab every parent and say, um, we're giving you a place to think about what you want for your child from mom to when you're thinking about it, whenever that is. And then we're giving you resources to plan um, for that. So, parents get busy and they forget that sometimes the best way to teach your child to take them out of the backyard and turn off the rock. So there's just some simple ways of, of uh, setting goals for yourself and for your child and for your whole family to become involved and to stay centered in, in the child's education. We all know um, that all our programs are based on this, that, that parents know their children the very best. And sometimes when they take their child to school, they give that responsibility of knowing your child the very best to their teacher. The teacher doesn't, won't ever know that. The teacher never thinks she does, but the parent sometimes thinks that the teacher will know her child better than, than them because they spend all the time with them. So when you look at the statistics, um, your child spends 91% of its time with you, not with the parent, with the teacher. But you know, things kind of messed up when you just push your kid in the door and, and you forget about them. So we're not about that. I think my time is up, Jen, as we're getting squirmy. <laughs> so if you have any any um, questions at all, please call us. And then I think you got a fact sheet about the environment and what we do about that. So thank you, Janet. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you.